Hi everyone, it's Lisa Wright, your semi-retired Gen Xer. I'm gonna explain why I've decided to collect Social Security at 62. Quite frankly, it's because my 90-year-old mother told me to. Now, I know what you're thinking. If you collect at 62, you won't be able to maximize your benefit. You should wait until you're 70. Sometimes life throws you a curveball, and in this case, the curveball is known as my 90-year-old mother. So the other day, my mom and I are chatting and we're talking about social security and says, Lisa, why on earth would you wait? Take the money now. And let me tell you, my mom, she's not one to exactly offer a dish out advice on a whim, but if she says something, she really means it. I know that I should wait until I'm 70. They say that you'll get more money each month, uh, about 8% more. But my mom's argument is why wait when you have now to enjoy it? And she's not wrong. I mean, we all know that life is unpredictable, especially after 2020. Who knows what could happen between now and 70? And it's not like I'm going to magically need more money at age 70 compared to 62. You see, my mom, she's been retired for 20 years. She waited until she was 70. Big regret for her. My mom's lived through wars, economic downturns, and more changes than I can count. And if anybody knows how to squeeze every drop of juice out of life, well, it's, it's her. She told me, Lisa, the money doesn't matter when you're 90 anymore. What matters is what you do with it when you're young enough to enjoy it. So go on the trips. Drink that nice bottle of wine. Enjoy your fancy cheese and olives. And let's be real. You know I do like a nice bottle of wine, cheese, and olives. As a Gen Xer, we grew up understanding that we had to work hard. We had to save for the future. We had to follow the traditional retirement plan. Grind through that nine to five. Max out our social security benefit and enjoy the fruit of our labor when we're older. But my mom has me thinking differently now. Maybe semi-retirement at 62 with a smaller social security check isn't that bad. You see, our generation didn't just grow up with the idea of working hard. We grew up with watching people overwork themselves into exhaustion. We saw people retire at 65 and finally start living their lives only to face health issues or to face burnout from decades and decades of overworking their lives. My mom even hit me with this financial logic. She said, sure, you could wait till you're 70, but what are you gonna do with the next eight years? Scrimp, save, just to get a slightly bigger check? Which is true. She did get a slightly bigger check when she waited. And again, she's got a point. If I collected 62, I can use that money now while I'm still healthy, while I'm still active, and still enjoying the perks of semi-retirement. Besides, I did the math. If I collect now, I'll get more payments over time, even if each one is smaller. If I wait until 70, yeah, I'm gonna get a bigger check, but I've missed out on eight years, which is 90 payments for me to enjoy my hobbies, my vacations, my wine, my cheese, my olives. The way I see it, life is about balance. Yeah, you want more with your money, but you also don't want to wait so long to enjoy it. I think she's on to something. Besides, I do trust her. I mean, she's got 20 years of retirement experience on me. So here's where I am. I'm collecting at 62. Because sometimes it's okay to take what's in front of you and enjoy the life. My mom always told me, don't wait for tomorrow, live for today. So here's to my mom and to making smart decisions that also bring us joy. Whether you take Social Security at 62, 65, 70, or anywhere in between, do what works for you. But if your 90-year-old mom tells you, I suggest that you listen. I really do appreciate you tuning in and sitting through my Collecting at 62 rant. Let me know in the comments if you're planning on taking Social Security early or are you going to wait? And if you got a 90-year-old mother with some strong opinions, I would love to hear her advice as well. And thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Take care.